about time. Well, I made it as fast as I could. It's Max Caper, isn't it? Where is he? I don't know. He said stake out Shifty and back him up when he makes a move. Okay, what's he trying this time? Who knows? You know Mac. Yeah, I know Mac, and I wish he'd give it up. A two-bit bookie. And every time we're loose, Mac's got to take a shot at him. How many times does this make? It's too many to count. Uh, here comes a customer. What the heck is he writing on? Chewing gum. Chewing gum? It's his new gimmick. It's bust-proof. You try to make a grab on him, and he just pops it in his mouth, and you wind up with a soggy piece of gum. Well, that's brilliant. But tell me, what's the big deal? Now, what does he take, a hundred bucks worth of action a day? Now, why doesn't Mac let the local vice guys handle it? I look alive. The show's about to start. the truth, brother. Wait a minute. You chewing something? What? Oh, yeah, gum. Say, how'd you know that? Good ears, friend. Good ears. No kidding, huh? Ain't that something? Like I say, uh, wear the cups when you really need them. Exactly. The Ben Ford Company, largest jewelry exporter in the country, been hit six times in the last three months. How much have they been in for? Half a million total. You know, I got a strange feeling. Robbery hit a dead end. They've unloaded it on us. Right on both counts. They picked up a couple of suspects, but it didn't lead anywhere. It seems they hire out for one job at a time. They don't even know where the jewelry's going. Nothing's turned up, huh? 
Not a trace. This is a pretty smart outfit. And I want to know who the master receiver is behind it, Mac. Consider it done. I wish I could share your eternal optimism. Have I ever failed you yet? Don't ask me. knock over that diamond salesman myself. That would really be like the blind leading the blind. Oh, that's cute. Uh, how much is he carrying? About 80,000 in uncut diamonds. DMO is right. They're going to hit him. And soon. Just commander to chase one. This is one. Go. Any action yet? Yeah, but we're keeping it a secret. Uh, negative, Chase Commander. The decoy is in the jewelry store. Chase Commander, Roger. Only one more stop after this. Looks like a no-go. Uh, this is Chase One. I'm going to go out on foot to get a better look at things. Roger, Chase One. Sing, you come out and take the other end. Roger, One. One to all units. Our man is coming out of the building. He's heading back to his car. Doesn't seem to be anything happening. Baker.
Don't try it. Don't try it. He wouldn't give it up. I told him to quit. He just wouldn't give it up. Well, he probably didn't give you much of a choice. He's had it. Chase one to chase commander. Come in. Scratch one thief. Two weeks work. Well, that's it. The last will and testament of John Doe Jewel Thief. It's not much to show for a hit like that. Did Prince come up with anything? Nothing. No record that we know of. His description doesn't fit the other jobs. Where does that leave us? Right back where we started from. He was waiting for a salesman, which means he knew the route he was traveling. He knew what any expensive stuff was going to be shown, too. Right. Which takes us back to whoever it is in the company who's tipping him off. Which takes us back to nowhere. Which is exactly where I knew you'd be when I got back. Well, it's nice of you to tear yourself away from obedience school and join us, Mac. Yeah, but I've been thinking. I've been watching my dog here, and I've been thinking. And the more I watch him, the more convinced I am that this dog is smarter than I am. Which translates into English as... Well, which means when this dog is hungry, he doesn't sit around and wait for food to come to him. He lets me know, and I go get it for him. Well, it's uh, certainly nice of you to volunteer. I didn't volunteer for anything. The halfway house. Our thief was there. It's all we've got. That sure is a long shot. Well, we take the odds that we got. Oh, by the way, Mac. Yeah, boss. Um... Listen, we got you on at 211 and ADW today. Let's try not to add to the list. But, Captain, I really think you care. Don't be silly. I'm tired of writing reports. You Cold beer. Um, let that beer, uh, let me have it in a bottle. <laughs> in a bottle? We got ourselves a real, genuine, hygienic fella here. Yes, we do. He thinks your glasses are dirty, Tom. <laughs> hey, when you get through with, uh, Mr. Clean there, bring us another round in a bottle. In one of those real French bottles you got saved in case you get royalty in here. <laughs> are you one of those, uh... Are you one of those ecology freaks? Not until I came in here. <laughs> uh, excuse me, does anybody in here own that car? Huh? Hey, do you always walk in and interrupt a gentleman's pool game? Look, I'm sorry, but I need some gas, and I can't get next to the You're pump. sorry. He said he's sorry. Did you hear that? Look, I didn't mean anything. You know, I've just about had it with punks like you. Yeah. Lousy hippie freaks. You know, I think... It's time someone taught you a lesson about being a man. Wrong, teacher. What? I said I was admiring your couth. Now, no, wait a minute. You don't want to do this. Mr. Clean, your time has come. <laughs> Well, that ought to improve his ear for music. What do you think?
Thanks a lot for that in there. Uh, hey, I'm sorry about the guitar, too. <laughs> Forget it. Couldn't play it anyway. <laughs> what do you mean you couldn't play it? What are you carrying it around for? Well, you never tell when I want to learn. Well, here's something else. Where are you going? Who knows? Anywhere where something's happening. You want to come along with me? Where are you headed? Oh, I'm just staying with some people at this old deserted house. An old deserted house? That's just temporary until Jock can buy the ranch. Well, who's Jock? <laughs> Jock's kind of like the leader. Well, I'm afraid you're, you're losing me. It's all right. I'm Little Bits. Hi, I'm Mac. Hi, Mac. I mean, you might, might as well come along, huh? Why not? Why not? Come on. Chase two to chase commander. Chase commander, go. Chase one is just passed with the suspect. Chase commander, you and Singh eyeball him. Keep me up to date. Chase two, out. I was hoping you were going to tell me it was. Oh, come on. It's not that bad. Anyway, wait till we get to the ranch. That's out of sight. Oh, I wish this was. The ranch? No, out of sight. Look, you wait here for a minute. I'm going to go in and see if Jock wants to meet you, okay? Right. Don't go anywhere. Where else will I go? Good thing. Okay, it's all set. Jock wants to meet you. Come on, dog. Uh, you better leave the dog here. idea at the time. Uh, what, what was your name again, man? Oh, come on, man. A little bit must have told you what my name was. Mac. And uh, what do you do? I'm a master at making anything happen. Slowly. I asked what you did. I just told you. You know, I'm losing my patience with you, friend. Well, that's too bad, pal. What are you, the ferocious fetus or something? Look, to me, you're just some flake who's got a lot of kids believing you're some kind of god or something. But as far as that... You know, I'd uh, hope that this would be necessary. But, uh... I think we need to know a little more about you. Again. Your full name. Uh, you 
Gerçekten. You guys play rough. Uh, now if that snake bites me, well, my dog is going to be very unhappy. trouble is, you see too many Fu Manchu movies. All right, what do you want to know? Just what are you doing out here? I was getting out of town. I got as far as the halfway house, and I ran into little bits. What was your rush? I had some trouble. Got in a fight, and someone called the cops, all right? And you don't like the cops? You look, I've done some time. It assaulted me away. Time for what? Passing some bad paper. Robbery once. Little bit's guessed right about you. That's good. What difference does that make to you? There are times when we can use a man with your talents. You know, wait a minute. I ain't risking my life for nobody but me. What about taking the risk for money? How much money? Would 10% of 70,000 renew your interest? You put me on. Believe me, I'm not. What, what do you need me for? You can do it yourself. Save yourself 7,000 bucks. Simple. We run no risk of getting caught. Provided you can get some fool to do it for you. That's right. 10%, 70,000. I guess I'm a fool. Good. On one condition. I want payment on delivery because I'm not hanging around this dump any longer than I have to. Within six hours, good enough? I can hang around that long for that kind of money. Fine. Get some rest. A little bits to show you where. Oh, uh, stay in shape, you know? You never can tell when you might need it. Hey, don't give me any routines, huh? I help you out, you bring me out here, and these guys do a number on my head. Take it easy, Mac. Come on, I know you're all right, but we gotta make sure, you know. Yeah, well, I still don't understand the setup. Oh, and it's not that complicated. We want to be left alone, away from society. So we figure on buying a ranch, live on it, work on it. And for this, you need money. Yeah, right. So when this guy approached Jock and asked him for some help, he saw a way to get what we wanted. Well, how do you know you can trust this guy? I don't know. I mean, he hasn't failed us yet. Right now, we've almost got enough money saved up to drop out. Don't worry. Look, I gotta worry. You see, because if I get busted, I'm going back to the joint. And I don't like to go into anything blind. Okay, okay, look. The guy tells us where to make the hit. He flies in here, picks up the stuff, pays us off, and he hasn't missed yet. <laughs> what else can I tell you? Well, I'm gonna go along with it, because the money's good. Ah, <laughs> the sight. See you later. Okay. Chase one to chase four. Click if you receive it. Chase one to chase four. Do you read? Uh, Freddy, things are beginning to move pretty fast. So uh, tell the boss to meet me uh, at a waterfall. It's about a mile north of here, around an hour before dark.
write a book. Hours, hard work, long periods of study, and for what? Just to get weekends off, a little more pay, and a heck of a lot more work. Headaches. Couldn't be helped, Chief. The jewelry cape is going down in the morning. In the morning? Oh, great. That's worth getting up at 4 a.m. for? This information could have waited until later. That is, unless there's... A catch. Just one more thing. Oh, hold it. Okay. Okay, now tell me. McRae's doing the job. It can't be helped, Chief. It just worked out that way. He's going to do the job, and the boss pays him off later. Oh, that's beautiful. Tell me if it isn't too much trouble. Does he shoot anybody during this robbery, or is it just a plain mugging? Well, we won't know about that until tomorrow. That's when they're going to give him the details. Oh, wonderful. Your visit here this morning, Chase, has accomplished two things. I will forever wonder about my sanity on the day that I consent to the creation of your outfit. And second, hmm? you've completely destroyed any notion I might have had about going back to sleep this morning. Have a good day, Chief. your wheels. Which one? Anyone, man. Take your pick. Too bad I don't belong to a union. A union? Yeah. I get time and a half for extra work. <laughs> Out of sight. adjustment. How can you tell? I used to work in a garage before I was married. Hey, if you've got a minute, I can just hop in there and adjust it in no time at all. No, I don't think that'll be necessary. Okay, we get the carburetor checked. Hey, I wish there was somebody who could tell me how to make this baby stop crying. Well, uh, check him out for diaper rash. Diaper rash? How can you tell? I used to work in a nursery. <laughs> Chase one to Chase Commander. Go ahead, Chase one. I'll hit the salesman at the Rollins building. Uh, there's a new wrinkle. I'm afraid to ask. Go ahead, Chase one. I had to rip a car. Dawson will love this. Roger, Chase one. I suppose we'll have to cover you. Hey, do you want to? No. I don't think I'll tell Dawson this one.
should have listened to that woman. Chase one to chase commander. Chase commander, go. I made the hit. Wasn't as hard as I thought. We'll be there shortly to cover you. I don't believe it. Righteous crooks don't have these problems. Chase one to chase commander. Chase commander, go. A black and white is gonna pull me over. I'm gonna need your help. Now I won't have to tell the chief. my lunch. All oh, right. Do you have any trouble? The air conditioning didn't work. <laughs> Jock, six hours from now. All right, take it easy. Man, just something else. Well, Fuzzer. I did, man, when I smell that green stuff. You know what I mean? Hey, what are you going to do with all that money? You're going to give me a bottle of scotch, hotel room. I'm going to buy me another guitar. Wait a minute, you can't play the guitar. I know that. I can tell, though, when I might want to learn. Besides, better than a club. Yes. Fine day's work, Mr. McRae. Yeah, that's what everybody keeps telling me, but uh, my palm is getting itchy. It need it's no more. The time has come. Chuck, my boy, those are the words I've been waiting for. We'll be back soon. Hey, what do you mean you'll be back soon? Just what I said, Gaylord, and I'll be back soon, and with us, your money. If you come back. I'm not going to give odds on that. 
Trust Mr. McCray. Trust. And besides, you really don't have much of a choice. He's right. I don't have any choice. Ah, it's okay. He'll be back. Nope, he won't. Well, this is Chase One. Hit it. What'd you do? Little bits. You're not gonna like this. But the only time that old Sam McCray has done is four lousy months in a police academy. Uh, you're a cop? One who wants to learn to play the guitar someday. Out of sight. Now don't go running off, I've uh, got a few friends that like to be. Hold it down, Mac. Get some more inside. Do it the easy way. Go get him, Fuzz. Time to join the party. Here, Fred can handle that. Come on.
your ranch. Well, congratulations. Thanks, Chief. I'll convey your happiness to the men. Sometime. That's all right. We'll play it your way. Here, take care of these. What's this about? Come on, what am I, public relations officer for the department? You are for right now. But this is... Look. One of your men, specifically a Sergeant Sam McCray, has been charged with grand theft auto, assault with a deadly weapon, and robbery. No, no one ever gave you a mandate to I break I suppose to do the jobs the other departments can't handle. To handle within the law. Oh, come on, Chief. Nobody got hurt. They got the car back. We caught a bunch of crooks. What more do you want? I don't want more. What I want is less. Less complaints about how your unit operates. Okay, Chief. I guess we can't recommend Mac for accommodation now. Accommodation? Chase, get out of here before I... Take care, Chief. Well, that about wraps it up. The Mexican Federales are moving in on the receiver. Harry Gleason's flight map showed a small landing strip south of Mexicali. Wherever he was meeting should be in custody by now. How are those reports going? Just about done, Captain. Real good of you to help out, Mac. Think nothing of it, Steve? Just don't make too many mistakes, huh? Uh-huh. Hey, boss. Nice and easy kiss. Oh, sure, Mac. Nice and easy. Huh? We cleared you on six robbery reports. Nothing to it. And in the process, we took reports on uh, a grand auto theft, assault with a deadly weapon, robbery, all with you as a suspect. I'll uh, see you later. Come on, you guys must be done by now. That's it. That is the last one. Oh, three o'clock. The day is finally over. Oh, no way. There are three more races left today. Races? Horse races? You're not going to the track. The track? Are you kidding? Shifty Carlin. I got an idea this oh, time that cannot miss Carlin. No, no, wait, wait a minute. No.